Hello YouTube, today we're going to talk about a soft defense item which is really cheap, you can find it in many places and uh, you can carry it in gun free zones and it's this carabiner here, or carabiner to be more correct now you can buy this in a hardware store for a couple of euros or dollars or you can get a more elaborate one from a uh, store that uh, sells uh, mounting equ climbing equipment I got this from a hardware store, you can see it's very cheap made, it's probably one and a half euros it has this security thing here that they cannot open up so you can go to a security a hardware store and you can find a grab that that fits your grip and as you can see it works more like a, a brace knuckle now in most countries brace knuckles are illegal I, could, I should have bought a probably a bigger one because this one if I try to put this like this it will not fit in my point finger here so I only have to put it like this and you can wear this so you can have it in uh, in your pants or something like this uh, unless you're wearing a suit of course that will be a bit awkward to carry a carabiner now the good thing with carabiners is that they're cheap you can uh, wear them almost everywhere uh, probably not airports because most of them are made out of metal and it can really enhance your punch now I should have started with, uh, with a disclaimer saying that any sort of improvised weapon if you are in a confrontation where there are weapons involved uh, you will have probably enough legal implications already so the best thing you can do is just walk away from that confrontation if you can uh, do that uh, especially if you're in a confrontation where the attacker although he's attacking you and you have some sort of improvised weapon like this or even a knife or something like that this will be difficult for you in the court in any country to prove that you were actually the one the people that was defending and not the one that was attacking take in mind that an average male person's punch let alone never made male person's punch enhanced with a carabiner or a brace knuckle can easily do a lot of damage to another person and even kill him if he faints and falls down and hits his head and something like that and it will be it will turn real ugly but it's nice to have a weapon with you all times as there's a Japanese saying that you carry a sword you don't know uh, you're probably gonna get attacked by someone with a sword probably once in your life so you have to carry a sword each day of your life or something like that to go something like this and this is it about the carabiner now one other thing about the carabiner or any other weapons for some sort of this thing uh, for instance if you carry a knife or a gun or whatever uh, it's the is the thing of deployment if someone attacks me with a knife for instance and or a carabiner and my carabiner or my weapon of choice is in my bag is it's like I don't have the weapon on me so the thing the same thing applies to the carabiner uh, you can put it in your belt loop or probably not in your belt loop in your pocket or something like this somewhere where you can have easy access to it and I really, I really can't stress this this much that you use a weapon only if it's your last resort and you are attacked by someone with a weapon uh, or by a big crowd or something like that you, you don't have any other options because otherwise you're gonna have legal implications in most countries let me stress that out and this thing costs as I said in the beginning probably one or one and a half euros it's not very it's not very good quality but for the purpose I got it probably some I carried it around in my belt and it gave me some sense of protection and you can carry you can let's say open carry this thing because it's not really threatening like carrying a knife or something like that anyway thanks for watching please like and subscribe